day after live. Woo! Um, so I, I know that some of you may not be able to join this evening because we were just with each other last night. Um, if you can pop on, that's awesome. If not, maybe you can watch the replay. Um, but I do have 100 items out. <laughs> Took me a little while because I haven't shown that many items before. I've been close. I think I, the most I've shown is like 75. So um, I, I have been close in the past. Hi, Laura. Thanks for joining. Hi, Tanisha. Thanks for joining. So like I said, um, the most I've ever shown is 75 items, and that was one time. So the 100 items is a lot. Um, but I do have it in my inventory. It was just deciding what I wanted to show you. And I didn't want to reshow some things that I've shown over the last couple of weeks. Um, I really wanted to give you some of the vintage pieces that I have in my inventory to show. I also, hi, Laura, I did get two boxes in today. Um, from So I was going to show those on Sunday, but I decided I would just go ahead. Hi, Tari, uh, Terry, thanks for joining. Um, I decided I would go ahead and show those two boxes today, too. Um, just, hi, Sherry, thank you for joining. So, um, like I said, it's a surprise live. My director um, challenged me to show 100 pieces tonight. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And um, then I will meet with you again on Sunday. But I'm going to go ahead and get started because it's a lot of items. <laughs> Okay, so first of all, um, item number one is this beautiful um, silver tone necklace that has your turquoise um, settings in it. So it's really beautiful, uh, much like a, a statement necklace, but not, not quite as bold, but it is beautiful. Um, and they, here you have your um, turquoise earrings that go with that. So that's item number one. If you're new um, to my show, uh, my name is Cynthia Warren, and I'm the owner of Cindy Sparkling Treasures. Uh, I sell paparazzi accessories. Hi, Sherry. Welcome, Hannah. Um, and everything is lead and nickel free. Everything is $5 unless otherwise stated. Right now, I'm paying the tax and the shipping um, on all items. Hi, Bob. So I was challenged. Normally, I go live 7 p.m. on Thursdays and Sundays. But our director challenged us to um, show 100 pieces today, and so that is what I'm doing to meet the challenge. So just getting started here, item number one is this silver tone necklace with the turquoise setting um, and your turquoise earrings. So that is item number one. Now, oh, Sherry, you want number one. You got it. Thank you. Okay, so... I was going to show you also um, to go along with item number one if you wanted it. Item number two, we have um, three beaded bracelets. So you have two of the silver beads and then you have your turquoise um, beads to go in there. So that's item number two. Hi, Terry. Thanks for popping in. Um, and then item number three is the turquoise ring that would match um, with that set if you wanted it. Okay, if you don't want it, that's fine. Um, maybe someone would want a bracelet and, bla oh, bracelet and ring that are turquoise. I'm flustered because 100 items is a lot. <laughs> but I am going to do it because when someone challenges me, I take the challenge every time. <laughs> oh, I'm crazy like that. Okay, um, item number three. Sticking with that same style of necklace, I have the same style necklace, and it is in the ivory, I like to call it the ivory turquoise style, because it's got that ivory stone with the brown lines running through it. So this is the same necklace, just in different color. So that is item number four. Okay, and with item number four, I found two rings um, in my inventory. So um, this would be item number five. So it's like a, oops, it's like a statement ring, okay? Um, and it's got that ivory stone with the brown running through it. So this is item number five. And then I found a second ring. And you don't have to, you can just get the ring. If you don't want to have it with the necklace, that's fine. 
um, I found another ring, which would be item number six. Okay, so it's it looks a little more antique um, looking than the previous ring that I just showed. So this is item number five. All right, now this particular ring, number five, would go very well uh, with this next necklace. So staying with that stone, but changing the style of necklace, I have a longer necklace. It's like an off, it's like a, a brushed nickel kind of, I guess I want to call it. And then down below you have your beautiful um, setting there, just like the setting in the other, except it's a different style. So this would be item number six, item number six. And the ring that I just showed um, does match this necklace even better than the previous necklace I showed with the similar stones. So um, item number seven, so seven and eight are bracelets that would match either one of those necklaces that I just showed you. So item number seven is this beautiful cuff bracelet. So you can see it has the cream colored stones with the brown running through it. Okay, so it's a cuff bracelet. And that is item number seven for $5. Item number eight I'm going to put this one on so you can see. So this is item number eight. Okay, same color stone with the brown running through it. Very much a statement bra uh, bracelet. Okay, it's on a hinge. It's item number eight. Okay, item number nine, going back to the same style as the turquoise necklace, I have it in an army green. Okay, it is a little a different style that it doesn't have one more layer hanging down, um, but you can see you have your army green um, stone there and then the same color for the earrings. So this is item number nine, item number nine. Okay, item number 10. We have a multicolor necklace. I'm gonna hold it up. So it's kind. Of, it would look kind of like this on your neck. So you've got your copper, your brass, and your silver. The chain is um, a, a brass, and then you have your earrings that are brass as well. So this is item number 10. Okay, item number 11, staying with the, the brass. I wanna show you number 11, this Bengal bracelet set would go great with that necklace that I just showed, if you would like that, item number 11. And then item number 12, so I'm looking, I was trying to pair complete sets for you. Um, item number 12, this ring, would also go with the um, the brass set. So I'm going to turn it to the sideways so you can see it's kind of, it's like a little raised square with that um, texturized look, which is what that stone, or uh, actually the, um, the metal has in it on that necklace. So this ring is 11, the bracelet is 12, and the multi-metal necklace is 11. Um, number four, Sherry. Let's see. So number four, it's not really a bright white. It's like a off or a cream white. I mean, it, it is white, but it's just not that um, bright white. It's like kind of like an off white with the um, the brown lines going through it. So that is this one. And then the other one, number six, is the one that had similar stones, but it has like the brushed nickel chain in here. So this is six. Oops. 
Okay. Um, let's see. So I'm going to stick with the multi metal for a minute. I don't want to get myself messed up here. So I stopped on 12. I'm on 13 now. So um, this is a beautiful necklace. I've sold a couple of these. It's no longer available on the website to my knowledge. Um, but again, you have another multi-metal um, necklace, much like a state necklace, very um, Native American looking to me. Um, and then you have your matching um, feather earrings that match what's hanging down from the necklace. So this is item number 13. And then to, um, if you would like to get a bracelet that matches either one of those sets, I do have a multi-metal bracelet. I've shown this before, so it's kind of got the uh, hammered look to it, and it's got your silver, your brass, and your copper. It is a stretch bracelet, um, and this is item number 14. One last um, combination um, necklace. Oh, there we go. Going to be item number fifteen. So it's it's not an extremely long necklace, but it does come down somewhat, and I'll show you in a minute. So you have your brass, and then up, up, up. You have your silver. Okay, with the textures on it. So I'm going to back up so you can kind of see how long it is, okay, comes to here. And then you have your tassel chain earrings, and this is item number 15. Um, so Sherry, I put, let's see, did I put four away for you? So Sherry, did you want four or Laura, did you say you already got that for her? Just let me know, Sherry, if you want number four and I'll put it aside for you, okay? Okay, um, item number 16 is up next. All right, so I'm gonna be switching around. I tried to organize colors, but I think I'm just gonna switch it up. <laughs> All right, so I did show this necklace before. I did show one last night that had a different, um, oh, you got it for her. Okay, but did you, you ordered it from me or from somebody else? Because I didn't have it put aside for you. I just want to make sure. Oh, Sherry. No, Sherry, is, you asked me that. Okay, I'm just looking at my messages real quick to make sure I didn't miss something. Okay, so you've got... Um, Sherry, or I mean, Laura, you want me to show number four. So this is number four. Coming closer. So just let me know if you want four or not, okay? All right, so item number 16. Um, I did show this last night in a topaz color. So I do still have the topaz available, but um, here it is in blue. Um, I believe it's coming out or has come out in red as well. So a beautiful necklace with your um, chain, tassel chain earrings, number 16. Okay, number 17. I had a bracelet to match this. Um, is a three-tiered necklace, so three layers, um, and it is your blue and silver um, beading, okay, with your blue beaded earrings, and that is number 17. Okay, I'm sorry. Now she, we blew her surprise. Oh, I'm sorry, Laura. <laughs> Well, at least you know she likes it, right? <laughs> oh, all right. Item number 18. This, I used to have it in a multi. One of you bought this from me in the multicolor. 
So here we have the um, flower necklace, silver tone. This has just the blue beads or the blue rhinestones inside of it and your earrings to match. Um, paparazzi had this at one time in a multicolor. Now they have it in white, pink, and orange. So they have three different necklaces. I did order it in white and I do have a white bracelet to match it. But what I wanted to show you is I have the blue and then someone bought my multicolor one from me and I don't know who it was, but I have the multicolor bracelet to match that set. Okay. Um, so the necklace is number 18. Okay. And the bracelet, which would also match, it wouldn't exactly match, but it has the same blue in it, is number 19 for the bracelet. Okay, and if you are the one that ordered the multicolor one, you might want to get the bracelet. <laughs> okay, um, item number 20. I know I've shown this before. Um, this is like a green moonstone. Um, it's silver tone necklace with your green moonstones and then your earrings to match. So this is item number 20. And then item number 21, I found a ring that matches this set in my inventory. So the ring has um, the butterflies. It's the butterfly ring that came in different colors. Well, it had, there's a green moonstone um, in there and then all throughout, you can see in various sizes with your um, clear jewels. So the necklace is number 20 and the ring is 21. Hi, Mary Beth, thank you for joining. Hi, Sherry, thanks for joining, Sherry Miller. If you're new to paparazzi or new to my show, I am a paparazzi independent um, consultant slash director. And um, I am selling jewelry for $5 unless otherwise stated. It's lead and nickel free. Um, right now I pay the tax and the um, shipping right now. And um, so I'm just on here showing 100 items out of my inventory. Laura wants 20 and 21. Thank you, Laura. You got it. Um, if you've missed any of my shows, you I have a YouTube channel, Cynthia Warren, um, Sparkling with a Flare. So you can always go back on my YouTube channel. My picture matches what you see there on Facebook. Um, and you can watch any of the shows that I have. Um, just write Laura's name down here. And um, also on YouTube. So you can go back and watch the shows and send me a message. Um, yeah, Sherry, Laura just ordered 20 and 21. I only had one set, I'm sorry. Okay, so you want Sherry four because the one I got her looks different. Okay, so you want me to give her four? Sherry, do you want four then? I'm going to put it aside <laughs> and you let me know otherwise. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. Oops. All right. So I stopped at 21. This hair is not being nice to me today. All right. 22. This is a copper necklace. I have two of these. Um, so it's a delicate chain. It's not extremely long, but here you have at the bottom, you have your black stone with the um, kind of like the V shape at the bottom and your black stone earrings, that's number 22. And then today I got in with my shipment, um, this ring. Oh, let me go to my other finger, show it better. So it does have the black, it's a little more shiny than the necklace, but if you wanted to pair it, I don't think it would look that bad. So this ring um, is item number 23. 
and the necklace was 22. Okay. Item number 24 is this beautiful um, silver tone necklace and here you have the emerald green stone. Um, it's got your little, I think they call that a lobster claw. No, something else, I can't remember. So here you have your necklace and then here's your earrings to match. This is item number 24. You're welcome, Laura. <laughs> so item number 24 is the necklace and then I have the bracelet to match, okay, which is item 25. So you can see they are a matching set. So the bracelet is 25, the necklace is 24. Okay, 26 and 27. I found a matching earring. Well, the earrings came today. So here we have your silver tone earrings with that tan stone in the middle on a fish hook. They're very pretty. You've got your dec decorative um, design in there. So that's 26. And then item 27 would be a bracelet set, which came in today as well. Um, and so you've got your petite, two um, petite bracelets in silver, and then you've got your tan beading with um, silver beads in between. So this is item 27. I'm going to hold them up together. So the earrings are 26, the bracelet is 27, and you can see they are a matching set with the stones. Toggle. Thank you, Mary Beth. I'm like, I... <laughs> It's not a lobster claw. Thank you, Mary Beth. I would have, that would have bothered me all night long. Thank you. <laughs> all right, 20, 28. All right, I have a gold necklace. It's shorter with your turquoise stones and your turquoise earrings to match. So it is gold instead of silver. This had come out earlier. Um, I think a, a month or so ago, and it was a double um, set in with the silver, which is no longer available. So this is item number 28. Okay, item number 29, I have two of these available, and I do have matching um, a couple matching ring options if you wanted it. So item number 29, and I did show these um, a couple shows ago, if not last night. Hi, Becky, thanks for joining. All right, so these are the silver tone um, earrings and you have your baby blue beading in there. So this is item number 29, and I do have two of these. Um, so I found some rings in my inventory and one came today. So the two, let's see, item number 30, would be the first ring, which you've seen before. So this is your baby blue triple stone um, ring. Okay, so I'm gonna hold it up with the earrings so you can see that they do match. Okay, so earrings are 29, this ring is 30. Item number 31 is another baby blue ring. I have shown this before. It's come out in a lot of different colors. Um, so this is the last one I have of the baby blue um, flowers, and then you have three moonstones in there. So um, this would be item 31, and I'll go ahead and put these up close so you can kind of see the color. Okay, so again, earrings are 29, this ring is 31, and then I do have a ring that came in today, which will be item number 32. This is a statement ring. It's a blue moonstone, and all encircled around it are your clear um, rhinestones. Okay, so that's item number 32. It's pretty, it's beautiful. 
<laughs> but it's big. <laughs> so if you like statement rings, that is that is one for you. All right, so I stopped on, next one is 33. Okay, number 33, I have a long silver tone necklace. And at the bottom, you have this circular uh, medallion that has those little petite white pearls with your alternating um, clear rhinestones. And then your earrings are your white pearls to match what is in the bottom. Okay, so this is item number 33. I found a ring that would match this, which is gonna be item number 34. So here is the ring. So you have your um, large oval pearl, and then all around that, you have your clear rhinestones. Okay, so I'm gonna hold it up together so you can kind of see that they do match. Okay, so necklace is 33, ring is 34. I think I forgot to mention if you're new, um, you just type in the number of the item that you would like and I get with you later offline about um, payment and shipping, okay? All right, item number, I'm losing track here, 35, item number 35. I found this in my inventory. I thought I had sold it because it's, it's kind of cool. I haven't seen any bracelets like this before in paparazzi. I'm sure they've had them and I just maybe didn't know. But um, it's two stretch bracelets. Okay, I'm going to take it out so you can see it better. Okay, so they're two separate stretch bracelets. Okay, but I like how they have the long piece and then you have your um, silver um, beading with your very light pink, just like a pastel pink it almost looks clear but a very very light pink or clear stone within that um, so this is item number 35 and then I did find a ring that would um, would match with this now this is like the green one I showed earlier except it's the pink moonstone okay so it's the pink moonstone with the butterflies um, and if I hold up the bracelet, okay, so 35 for the bracelet, 36 for the ring. Okay, I'm going to circle back around. All right, so I'm on item number 37. Okay, so 37, um, I have an orange wrap bracelet. So this is like a bright orange leather wrap bracelet. Okay, it's got two, um, two settings on it. So if you have it on your wrist, it's gonna look something like this. This is item 37. And in my inventory, I found a ring that would match. So the ring is going to be 38. I'm going to hold it up so you can kind of see. So here's the ring. You've got your orange stones in there. And so if I hold it up here, it kind of offsets. Okay. So the ring is 38 and the bracelet is 39. Okay, um, item number 40. This is really cool. This came today in my order. Um, I hadn't seen this on the website. I don't think they have it anymore. Probably sold out. It's a similar bracelet. They are stretch, um, but it's held together. So you have three bracelets, but it's held together with this beautiful little silver feather, double feather. Okay, so you've got your blacks, your silvers, your reds, and your um, brown beads. Sorry, I went down and you couldn't see. 
All right, so you can see the difference and then boom, you're back to your feathers. So this is item number 40. Okay, item number 41 is a cuff bracelet, just a simple little um, three-tiered cuff bracelet. Okay, item number 41. Uh, Laura, you want 40? You got it. Thank you, Laura. Okay. All right, so item number 42. I've shown this set before in gunmetal and I do still have it in gunmetal. I think I bought a couple of them. Um, and I may have shown this before in silver, but here we have number 42 is a large, uh, just a big group of bangles. They're not connected together, so you could wear them all at once or just wear a couple of them. So we have two, four, six, eight, nine silver bangles, um, and they have the alternating. Um, so you've got one that's like this, and then the next one has the texture, okay? So that's kind of the, the whole um, pattern of the bracelet. So you've got one that's kind of like flat and another one that has the texture. There are nine there, item number 42 for $5. All right, item 43, I have a ring, silver tone, um, a pastel pink stone, and then you have your um, clear stones there at the bottom, your clear rhinestones. They take it off so you can see, come a little closer. I've had too much coffee today. <laughs> item number 43. All right, item number 44 came today in the mail. Um, it's a wavy ring and it has, to me, if it's, it looks black, it looks like black rhinestones. It could be a very deep, deep purple, but it, to me it's black. Um, in the silver. So this is item number 44. Also came today, item number 45 is a, it's a gunmetal um, ring and it has just, it's blinged out with all of these beautiful clear rhinestones. So item number 45. Okay, item number 46, I've had this before. I bought a lot of these before they sold out and I kept buying them because every time I'd sell out here and there'd still be some on the website, other people would want them. So I'd have to reorder. So I ordered an extra one and now I've had the extra one. So this is a silver tone ring that has this beautiful pastel pearl in the middle and then a pink pearl and uh, then you have your clear rhinestones. Okay, so that's item number 46. Item number 47 is a oops, sterling silver, I mean not sterling silver, it's a silver tone ring that has um, your pink, it's like a little flower, and it has a single pink rhinestone in the middle. Okay, so that's item 47. Okay, item number 48 and 49. I have three of these bracelets and one of the earrings. So I paired them um, together or I kind of grouped them together because the stones match. But again, I have one of the earring and three of the bracelets. So um, item number 48, it's a double bracelet um, that separates. So you don't have to wear them both at the same time. And you've got your silver tone with your, um, your tan or beige brown um, beads, okay? 
you could actually buy, if you like a chunkier look, you could buy two of these and get four bracelets or buy all three and have six so that you have a thicker look to your bracelet if you like that. These bracelets do have, they're not heavy, but they have a little bit of weight to them because they have the circular um, silver, they, they almost look like weights to me. All right, so this is item number 48. And item number 49 is going to be the earrings that match, and I'll show you that up close. So item number 49 are these earrings that are silver tone with the um, the tannish brown, kind of the off brown. I'm gonna hold it up now so you can kind of see um, how the browns match. So 48 is the bracelet, 49 is the earrings. Okay, number 50, we're halfway there. <laughs> Number 50 is a gold tone necklace called Spellbound. I have this in silver and I love it. Um, I'm a silver kind of gal. I like gold too, but so I'm going to go back a little bit so you can see the necklace ends right here with the oval shape. So I'm going to go like this. This is kind of how it would look on your neck. Okay, just very beautiful with the ovals hanging down at different levels. And then you have your oval gold gold tone um, earrings is to match and that's item number 50. All right, item number 51. I have these beautiful silver tone earrings with a light or a pastel purple um, jewels at the bottom that are just sparkling in that light, aren't they? That's beautiful. So that's item number 51. Item number 52, these also have the light purple rhinestones, but it's, the earring is a little bit smaller. So this is item number 52. So you have your smaller earrings and these are kind, it's kind of in, it looks set in, okay. Um, item number 52. Item number 53. These came today. Item number 53. These are post earrings. And they have the orange, as you can see, the orange um, beading. And then you've got your beautiful design around that. Again, looks very Santa Fe-ish to me. Um, so item number 53 in orange. Three, okay, 54. Um, I actually got these from another consultant and um, I like them, but I said to myself today as I was watching them sit over on my printer before I took them to my jewelry box, I should share these just in case anybody likes them. Oh, Becky, you want 52? You got it. Becky wants 52. Okay. Thank you, Becky. All right. Um, okay, so anyway, I these must be a vintage pair of earrings from Paparazzi. Um, I have several pairs that look similar to this that are the pink moonstone, and I know Pam had bought a pair from me and a couple of other ones, but this is just such a unique color. So I love I love these earrings. Um, so you've got your clear rhinestone, you've got some clear rhinestones, but then you've got almost like this aqua blue moonstone type of um, color in these jewels at the bottom. I love it. I, I just, it's so pretty um, and the light catches it really well. But with these earrings, these are the ones that I had said before. See how this comes off. Okay, so you don't have to wear that piece. You can get a different look by just wearing the post. Or if you want to 
wear it as one piece to the front of the ear. It's going to look something like that. Or if you put it the post first and the piece to the back, I'm going to try to do this without dropping it. <laughs> it's going to give you like a 3D look. Okay. So it, your ear would be in between here and this would be at the back of your ear. So it gives it a more 3D look, okay? So this is item number 54, if you're interested in those. Okay. All right, item 55. I was so hoping that these would match the um, the army green, but they didn't. This is a kind of a lighter a green color, these earrings. But here we have the silver tone with the green. Um, it's kind of like a lime green almost with the brown lines. Okay, so this is item number 55. Okay. Item number 56, silver tone earrings. I've shown these before. So they are, it's like a mint green with um, a little bit of gray. So I'm coming closer so you can see. So it's like a mint green stone with a little bit of your gray colored stones on the inside. And it's like an off silver color, number 56. All right, number 57. We have some copper earrings, so I'm going to separate them so you can kind of see. Okay, so here. Copper earrings, number 57. All right, these are really pretty. <laughs> number 58, and you wonder why I sell paparazzi. I get this jewelry and I'm like, oh, oh. <laughs> um, item number 58. So it's a silver tone earring and you have your smoky jewels. Isn't that pretty? I love the smoky, if you can't tell, because I've got my smoky jewels on today. <laughs> so this is item number 58. This came in today. I want to show you a necklace and earrings that also came in today that are smoky jewels that I think are, is still available on the website the last time I looked today. Um, and I say that last time for today because every it sells out really quickly. But these earrings that I just showed, item number 58, would also match the necklace, but there is a pair of earrings that match perfectly with it. So I'm gonna show you item number 59, which is a necklace. It's a long chain, silver tone chain. And at the bottom, look at those smoky jewels. Isn't that pretty? I'm going to try to do this so you can see a little better. Okay, and then your earrings are the smoky um, rhinestones. There it goes. Okay, so this is item number 59. And I'm going to hold it here for a minute while I get the earrings. So you see how this is like a teardrop shape. And then you have your smoky jewels here. So item number 60 are the earrings that match. My earring just got, hold on one second. There it goes. So item number 16, 60 are the earrings that match. Isn't that pretty? I love it. <laughs> So 60 is the earrings, 59 is the necklace, and I just want to show you how well, okay, I can't even, there we go. All three really match. It's just the earrings, the other earrings match more perfectly. All right, so um, Mary Beth wants 58 and 59. Okay, so this is 58, Mary Beth, right? And then oh, what am I doing? 58. 
<laughs> no, 59. Okay, so Mary Beth, you want this set. Oh, 60. Okay, I was wondering. All right, so you want 59 um, and 60 then, the matching set. You got it. Thank you. Okay, yeah, those are so pretty. So, so pretty. I love it. Okay, um, item number 61. I think this might still be available on the Blockbuster tab of the website, if you guys have been on there. It's a shorter necklace. It does have the two-inch extender on it. But it's just a simple um, white rhinestone and then your white rhinestone earrings. So just a very simple necklace. Okay, this is item number 61. Item number 62, I have um, available in two different colors. So I have one of the red, so it's the thin red leather, soft leather. Um, and then you have four, five layers of chain. I'm going to back up so you can see. It does have the two inch extender. And then you have your chain earrings that come with that. That's item number 62. Okay, um, Becky wants 61. You got it, Becky. Thank you. Okay, so this is 62, okay, in the red. I also, I have one red, and then I have item 62 also I have in the, um, the pastel blue or the aqua blue. So it's got your leather strap and the same chains that is within the red, okay? So I have one red and two of the blue, item number 62. Thank you, Becky. Okay, item number 63. Um, I think I showed this on the show where we did the summer colors, but this is a multicolor necklace, silver tone. You've got your beautiful um, pastel beads, and then you've got some of your... Um, shell. I like to call them the shell beading. <laughs> I don't know. Um, it's just really pretty, very multicolored, very summerish. Um, so this is item number 67. I mean 63. Sorry, my phone's going off and I'm losing my train of thought. 63. Item number 64. I have this necklace. I've shown it before. I think it's still available on the Blockbuster tab of the website. Um, and Pam did get this necklace too. Um, so I bought another one because I just think it's so beautiful and it has all your summertime colors in it. Um, so this is a, it's called the Kaleidoscope. It's a longer necklace. And I'm going to come up so, let's see, I'll back so you can kind of see. So where my hand is at the bottom is where it ends. Okay. So you've got your yellows, your pinks, your oranges, your blues. And um, you've got your connected silver within there. Okay. The chain doubles over to hold the next layer of um, the necklace design. And then your earrings are the pink. Um, flattened beads. All right, so this is item number 64 for the kaleidoscope necklace. Uh, 62, and can I get the aqua blue earrings you showed earlier? Yes, absolutely. Okay, so. Okay, now, was this the blue? No, that's the was this the earrings you wanted, number 56, Laura? I don't know. I don't know if you're trying to get a match. Ooh, 
Oh, look, these would match. If you're trying to get a match, 54 matches. <laughs> I don't know if you like those kind of earrings or not. No. This is, this is the stud earrings. Um, I, the only other ones that might match would be number 29. Oh, 54. You want 54? Okay. All right. So you've got 54 and you've got um, 20, 62. You got it. Thank you. Okay, awesome. Hi, Pam. <laughs> Do I have a ring that matches? Uh, let's see. Where did I just put my blue rings? Hold on one second. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Um, this one does not. It doesn't. Okay, I don't know what you think about this. Let me show you. It's very, it's very close. Okay, so you have your You have your necklace. I'm trying to get it with the, um... okay, so earrings, necklace, and ring. What do you think about that, Laura, with the ring? That's about the, that's the only color of ring that I have right now that would match. Just let me know, Laura. I'll go ahead and put this aside and keep going. Okay. So you've got 62 and 64, and I'm waiting to hear if you would like to have number 31, the ring. Because the other ring I was thinking, this one doesn't really, it's kind of, I mean, it does kind of match, but it's a little more blue than the necklace. Okay, so you have a ring. Okay, you're good. You're good. No problem. All right. Okay, this is 62. 63. I just showed the kaleidoscope necklace. 64. All right, we're on to 65. Okay, so item number 65 is a um, silver tone necklace. I have this in gold as well, I believe. I don't think I sold it, but um, silver tone, and you've just got a whole bunch of circles below. Just beautiful, um, shorter necklace with a little bit of a statement there. Um, so silver tone, as you can see, in your circular earrings to match, item number 65. Okay. All right, so item number 66, I have two necklaces that are the same design in different colors. Um, the first one is purple. So we have our silver tone chain with the purple beading. Okay, and then you have your purple earrings. So that's item number 66. I also have it in red. So here we have it in red, and I wouldn't be surprised if it comes out in yellow soon. <laughs> yellow seems to be a big um, color for this summer. 
So this is also item number 66, red. So I have it in red or I have it in purple. Okay, so item number 66. Okay, item number 67 is a longer red necklace um, with beads. This is a very, it's a very pretty, it's kind of like shimmery red. I want to call it a shimmery red bead. Um, so I'm going to go back so you can kind of see how long it is. So I'm going to hold it up. Where my hand is is where the bottom of the necklace ends. Okay. Now you can, um, like I've said before, with the longer necklaces, you can, um, you know, make them double them. So you have a shorter and a longer, but not as long as what this would be. So within it, you have all your little um, silver tone trinkets and beading and design, okay? And then you have your red beads to go, beaded earrings. That's item number 67. All right. Item number 68, I have a necklace ring bracelet. So 68, 69, and 70, if you want a matching set. Okay, so first I'll go with the necklace. It's a triple layer necklace. It is very, it's like the blue one that I showed earlier, number 17, okay? So the, this necklace is red, number 68. Three layers of um, chain with your red and silver beading. And then you have your um, red beaded earrings to go with that. That's item 68. I also have the bracelet that matches. Okay, so I'm just showing you it's the identical set. You have two layers for your bracelet that are connected together. Um, it is adjustable, and this is item 69 for the bracelet. So 68 for the necklace, 69 for the bracelet, and number 70 is the ring. So here is the ring, okay. So 68. Necklace, 69, bracelet, 70 is the ring. Okay. Oh boy, all right. 71, these came today. <laughs> I remember when I was younger, I used to love to wear hoops. And I still like hoops, but I don't know. I think when I got older, I was just like, I don't know. But these are some big hoops, but they're pretty. But I just don't think I could pull it off anymore. <laughs> so item number 71 are these um, gunmetal hoops. I'm going to go to the side so you can see how big they are. Um, so I really, I like them, and they're very lightweight. Okay. So item number 71. Item number 72. Okay, so 72, I have several options going on with a couple different necklaces. So, here we go. Oh, you know what? I think I have a bracelet. Um, hold on, guys. I think I have a bracelet. I'm just thinking. doesn't really match okay well I can show you this bracelet later all right it's pretty all right so item number 72 silver tone chain you've got your teardrop clear jewels okay so it's two layers of chain at the bottom okay and you've got your clear teardrop jewels and then your 
teardrop earrings. Item number 72. Okay, so item number 73 is a ring that would match this set. If you like the statement rings, you'll probably love this one. Um, so item number 73. Okay, it's a bigger um, teardrop clear jewel. And I want to hold it up so you can. Um... Oh, Pam, thank you. <laughs> I'd look cute in those, those hoops. <laughs> so you can see it does complement the necklace very well. The ring does. So this necklace is 72 and the ring is 73. Um, if you wanted to have a bolder look with your earrings or a secondary look, which would also match this ring very well, number 74 are these teardrop post earrings. Okay, so you can see it would match the ring. Oh. And um, it could give you a secondary look with this necklace, just a little bolder look. So these earrings are number 74. Okay, now number 75, You the ring or the secondary pair of earrings that I just showed you would, would also pair with 75, although it is beautiful just the way it is. Um, so 75, it's a more petite chain. And at the bottom you have your, you have pearls, white pearls, and then you have your teardrop clear jewel settings and some circular, circular clear um, rhinestones in there. And then your earrings are these petite little teardrop. So very pretty, very pretty necklace, number 75. <laughs> Aw, you guys are sweet. All right, number 76. Oh, I wanted to show you this. Oh, I'll do this now. Number 76 is the bracelet that I thought would match those, but it's it won't because um, on the inside, it's like the gun metal, uh, metal instead of the silver. But anyway, it's a stretch bracelet and it's all clear um, jewels. So it's almost, well, mine's a little bigger. So clear jewels, all circular stretch bracelet number, number 76. Now, if you know anybody that's getting married in June or July or over the summer, some of these pieces, especially the ones I just showed you with the pearls and the the clear jewels, that goes very well. Um, also, if you know anyone that plans on getting married and they're looking for like bridesmaids, um, jewelry or jewelry for the bride, you know, I can I can always hook you up with some jewelry for something like that as well, okay? So don't forget me. <laughs> All right, item number 77. I showed this necklace last night and it sold. And I forgot I had ordered another one, which came today in the mail. And I'm like, oh, I do have another one. So I wasn't sure if anyone else had wanted this necklace last night, but I do have another one now, thanks to the UPS guy. So it's the black chain, and then you have your emerald um, stone, you have the smoky jewels, and then you have the dark purple um, jewel at the bottom. And then you have your tassel chain earrings to match the chain within the necklace. So it's a very beautiful piece. Item number 77. And I do want to tell you something before I keep going. Okay, so I'm on 77. I'm going to write down 78. Okay. Um, I had... I don't know, I'm not gonna say name because I don't know if it's okay, but I just wanna tell you, if you've bought um, several pairs of paparazzi necklaces, um, that ha if you have several pairs of the chain, tassel chain earrings, and they're all like the same, you know how you get your tassel earrings with the silver necklaces and they're all kind of the same. Um, 
normally we don't need that many pair of tassel earrings. And um, so I had a lady that's here on the show and she's a dear friend. And she was telling me that she donated tassel earrings and some other things to um, the battered women's shelter. And that, you know, of course the women, some of them were crying, you know, they haven't had, some people need to leave right away from their home and they can't take their clothes or their jewelry or things like that. And so it just really brightened the day of these women and made them feel special and like a woman, because, you know, we like to, we, we all may wear different styles of jewelry or maybe not as much jewelry as others, but it's one thing that makes us feel feminine, you know? And so when she told me that story, I was just so taken back by it because just such a big heart she has. And I'm going to start doing that with my stuff. I'm going to put aside the extra tassel earrings or, you know, maybe even buy some pieces and, and, um, pay it forward and donate them to the women's shelter. I thought that was just such a special thing that she did. And um, I just want to thank her for sharing this story with me. And I wanted to share it with you. All right. So um, item number 78. Silver tone chain. And we have these beautiful, this just, beautiful silver design here and within the design you have nestled in there some clear rhinestones I don't know if you can see it I'm going to come a little closer so you have some clear rhinestones in there and um, the hammered look and some smoothness and then your your earrings to match so this is item number 78 Okay, item number 79. Silver tone necklace. They do have this in gold as well, but I don't, I'm not sure that I have it in my inventory. So they call this, I think, the fishnet. So as you can see, it really does look like a fishing net at the bottom, but within that are your clear rhinestones kind of just nestled all throughout the bottom so i'm going to back up a little bit so you can see there <laughs> okay so and then your chain earrings to match so this is item number 79 okay item number 80 silver tone necklace with these beautiful um, clear stones, clear jewels, I should say, not stones. And then you have your earrings with the clear jewels as well. Number 80. Okay, I'm gonna move on to some purple. So number 81. And I do have other purple stuff, um, but I just chose a few. Um, so number 81, it's a long chain, silver tone, and at the bottom you have a beautiful purple um, stone. And then your earrings are the tassel earrings. So that's number 81. I also have this, I showed last night in a different color. Um, so if you're looking for something like that, hi, Lisa, thanks for joining. All right. So this is number 81. Okay. Number 82, if you like wood beads, um, this is a wood bead necklace. I know I've shown this before. Um, I'm going to go back a little bit. So you can see the beads at the chest area are bigger and then they graduate to be smaller. Um, and then here you go with your beaded earrings and this is purple again, item number 82. Okay, item number 83. I'm gonna stick with the bead, the wooden bead for a minute. So 83, these are more, these are flattened um, wood. 
and you have three tiers on the necklace, three levels. Um, you're, it's not a chain, it's, um, I don't want to call it yarn, it's like brown heavy string and then you have your slip knot there um, and you have your purple flattened earring there. Okay, so these are wood, it's a lightweight wood, it's very beautiful. Um, item number 83. Okay, item number 84. I have several of these in different colors. Um, so I'm showing purple tonight, but I can certainly get you a different color if you would like. So this is the ribbon in the pearl necklace. So we have a purple ribbon. The necklace, it ties, okay? So you can make it as short or as long as the ribbon will let you make it, okay? So um, it can be longer, it can be shorter, it can be doubled to give you a look, a diff the look that you want. So then we have silver tone chain and you have your purple beads throughout or pearls and then your purple pearl earrings. I also have this in brown, black with silver beads and pink. Okay, and I may have it, no, I don't have it in, I don't have it in white, I don't think. So this is number 84. Laura, you want 83, you got it. Thank you, Laura. Okay. Okay, 34, so that would be six. Okay, so I'm going to show you some rings. So number 85. I have a silver tone ring. It has flowers and then nestled within the flowers are the black rhinestones. So you can kind of see how those black and smoky rhinestones are um, shimmering there. You have your little flowers for your detail. That's number 85. Hi, Rita, thanks for joining. All right, number 86. This is like the tiger eye stone. So there's three tiger eye stones <laughs> in a silver um, ring there. That is item number 86. Okay. Item number 87 black stone ring and all around you have your clear um, rhinestones on either side. This is at number 87. Number 88. Oh. This is pretty. So it almost looks like three rings in one. It, it is all connected, but it has your black um, rhinestone or setting your jewel, and then you've got your smoky jewels down here. So if I take it off and come a little closer, you can kind of see how it looks like almost three rings in one. This is item number 88. All right, item number 89. If you like the navy blue, this is a beautiful navy blue teardrop stone in a silver setting, number 89. All right, number 90. 
be glad when when they come back out when paparazzi comes back out with the um the red stones that look like the rhinestones or the turquoise i mean um because this ring reminds me of that so here we have a beautiful red um turquoise style stone number 90. Okay, 91, I have a simple silver ring that looks like a diamond, shaped like a diamond, um, and it has the hammered look. Okay, so that's item 91. Okay. I don't know what I want to show you next. Item number 92. This is pretty. It's got, um, okay, so this is item number 92, and it is a silver tone ring, and it looks kind of like, kind of like a buckle ring. It's got your texture and the interlocking circle there. So item number 92. Okay, let me see where I'm at. Okay, so I'm going to stop with the rings and I want to show you, um, uh, let's see, where did I stop at, 94, let me just show you two more rings and then I'm going to show you some Z collection, okay, so 95, And 97. I'll show you three more rings. Okay, so number 95 is a yellow stone. I know some of you have bought the yellow um, necklace sets from me, so I wanted to show you this ring, um, which would be item number 95. Item number 96, we have an orange stone ring. You've got some um, texture there and some little, looks like little silver beading. So this is item number 96. And then item number 97 is a dark green ring. And these are just, it's not beads, it's just like, it looks like beading, um, but it's the silver inset of the ring. So this is item number 97. Uh, Laura wants 95. You got it, Laura. Thank you. Five is the yellow. You got it. All right. Okay. And 97, you got it. So 95 and 97. You got it, Laura. Thank you. Okay. Um, do you have any army green? Um, I you know what I have let's see. Hold on one second. I'm looking for the army green for you. Let's see. Uh, okay. Um, oh. Kind of match. No. All right. 
So the only greens, Laura, that I have right now, I'm, I need to get some more greens um, that are the army green, but they haven't, they seem to be like the summery color greens right now. But, um, you know, I showed this earlier. So this is, this was item number nine. Okay. And then I do have this necklace, which is, has that green to it. And here are the earrings. So I have that. And then I have one bracelet. So it's three bracelets in one. Uh-oh. So you've got the silver tone stretch. Then you've got your green. And then the this other green that goes with it that has the little medallions around it. So this is a set. Okay. And those are that's the only thing close to army green that I have. So I don't know if you like any of those items or not. So necklace, bracelet, and then the necklace that I showed earlier, which is number nine. So that's the closest I come to Army Green. You want the bracelet, you got it. Okay. All right, I'm gonna put your name on that. Thank you. All righty. Oh, you want, do you want the short neck? The necklace is short. Do you want that necklace? Just let me know if you want this necklace, Laura. Okay. I'll hold it aside until I hear from you. Okay. Um, so now what I'm going to do is show you um my z collection that i have um i don't know if you followed um on facebook but okay great laura i'll put your name on that thank you um so the z collection that was on the website is all sold out and they're coming out with new z collection necklaces and if you've heard me talk about it before, this what's special about the Z Collection necklaces are that um, consultants within the company that rank at a certain rank, they're able to design their own necklace and name it, from my understanding. <laughs> Tell me if I'm wrong, Terry, because I see you're on here. Um, and so it's a really special honor, and they're really special necklaces because of, of how they're, they come about. So um, the Z collection necklaces are $25 and um, they're all sold out on the website. So what I have in my, in my inventory, you won't be able to find them on a website and they won't remake them as far as I'm aware. So I just wanna show you what I have. If you're interested, these are $25. Um, I do have two of these necklaces so the, this necklace is um, pearls and your clear rhinestones. And then you have your beautiful um, earrings to match. So I have two of these, okay. And that will be, sorry, I didn't even tell you the item number that I, I'm just, let's just call that one 100. <laughs> and I'm gonna keep going. So that's gonna be 100 if you like that necklace. And then 101 will be this beautiful turquoise necklace. Okay, so it's gonna come closer so you can kind of see it. Very stylish necklace. Um, and if you like, like turquoise, it's, and again, these are really statement necklaces. Um, so this is item number 101. Okay, item 102, I'm going to show these on the, they're easier to show what they look like when I put them on the, um, 
the display. Okay, so item number 102, you have gold tone chain. You have just a, a bunch of pearls that are nestled within the chain to come all the way down to this gathering of these beautiful white pearls um, and then your earrings to match. So this is item number 102. Item number 103, we have the silver tone. Um, and this necklace also has all throughout, I'm gonna come closer so you can see the clear jewels and the varying sizes of the white pearls that make up this necklace. And then your earrings are the same. They have varied size of white pearl with your clear rhinestones within the necklace. So this is item number 103. Okay, item 104, this is another um, turquoise necklace. I'm gonna back up so you can kind of see how long it is. So it is a longer necklace. Um, it has four layers of turquoise, and then you have some brown um, stone within, okay, some brown stones and beads, and then your earrings to match. Okay, so this is item no number 104. Item number 105, if you, if you like the brushed nickel look or the, it's actually, it's more, um, it's like a, like a lighter, like a silver, dark silver chain. Um, so this is 105 and you have your clear um, jewels and your black sparkly jewels. And then you've got this chain nestled throughout the necklace. So a lot of layers on that necklace. And then at the very bottom, you have this beautiful teardrop um, stone. So that's item number 105. Okay. Item number 106. If you like chains and black um, smoky jewels, rather smoky jewels, this is the necklace for you. <laughs> so this is item 106 and it is just beautiful five layers of chain at the bottom, um, three layers here. When you get into your smoky jewels, then it goes into five layers of chain. So I'm gonna back up where my hand is, is the bottom of the necklace. Okay, and then you have your tassel chain earrings with that. So this is item 106. Oh, I lost an earring. Okay, item number 107. This is really pretty. So it's closer to your neck. It's not long. Um, it's not a choker by any means, but it lays very nicely at the neckline. Um, so this is item 107. So you've got nestled in there your smoky jewels um, and you have your clear jewels as well and the earrings to match. Very, very pretty, 107. Oops, I 
this is a beautiful one too i love them all really so you've got your silver chain so i want to come closer so you can see that chain and then nestled within here you have your clear beads and your smoky jewel beads okay and your earrings to match so it's clear and smoky jewel so it matches perfectly with the necklace this is item number 108 And we have two more and that's it. All right, so 109. You've seen me show this one before probably. I think it's just such a cool necklace. I'm gonna take it out so you can actually see it. So 109. Okay, so these are the earrings for 109, okay? And the necklace, what I like about it is this is a leather strap. And then look at the detail on even just the back of the strap where you've got your clear, um, not your clear, yeah, your rhinestones. And then more leather strap. And then it comes down to this beautiful mirrored. So it looks smoky, I think, because I'm holding it over my black computer. But these are like mirrored jewels, okay? And um, I just love it. It's And it's not too heavy, you know? It's a pretty good, um, it's not heavy like some of, some of the others might tend to be. And it's just, it's. I like the leather and the stone look, I guess, for me. So um, this is 109. 109 and then the last one will be 110 okay so 110 if i can get it turned correctly on the this is 110 so again it's your large statement jewels they're clear. It is closer up around your neck. It is adjustable as well. Um, so this is item number 110. Okay, so that is all I have for this evening. I really, really thank you all for joining me. Uh, I know we were together last night and I appreciate you hopping on again, but I had to meet my director's challenge. So you all helped me do that. And I would just want to thank you so much for being here. Um, again, feel free to share my website, share my videos with your friends and your family um, or and anybody else you think that, um, or you know that they love jewelry, um, share my website, share my uh, videos and um, invite them on to my shows. Okay. So um, thank you so much. And I will see you again on Sunday. And I promise it won't be a hundred items this time. <laughs> thank you so much for joining. In the meantime, if you need anything specific, um, if you're looking for something, just give me a, give me a message and I will do my best to find what you're looking for. Thanks so much. Good night.